Natural green spaces are a vital part of Edmonton's ecosystem. They are essential to building a healthy, climate-resilient city for you and future generations. That's why the city of Edmonton has reverted some open spaces back to a more natural state. This process is called naturalization, and it started decades ago. White Mud Drive, Victoria Park Hillside, and Grote Road are examples of successful naturalization projects from those early days. Today, city naturalization projects are happening all around you. Along roadways, to reduce noise levels and mowing maintenance costs. In park spaces, to provide habitat for native plants and wildlife. In communities, to connect us to nature in our own backyard. In stormwater ponds, to absorb rainwater, which protects banks from erosion and reduces the risk of flooding. Naturalization is a three-step process that takes many years to establish. In stage one, we prepare the site, adjust mowing, control weeds, and monitor the area. In stage two, we plant trees, shrubs, or allow passive naturalization, which means allowing the natural expansion of existing tree stands or grass areas. In stage three, we care for the newly established area by continuing to monitor growth and planting more trees and shrubs if necessary. To date, the city has naturalized nearly 1,000 hectares of maintained land. The city has a goal of planting 2 million trees by 2050, but we are working on reaching that goal sooner. The city also has a larger goal of growing the city's forest canopy coverage by 20% by 2071. Naturalization will be a part of meeting these goals. Learn more about the city's naturalization program and how you can get involved at edmonton.ca slash naturalization.